From California State University, San Bernardino, it's Local Matter. Behind the scenes of a bowling alley and hairstylist. Hello, I'm Maria Torres and welcome to Local Matters, featuring stories from across the Inland Empire. And I'm Joe Mosley. Have you ever wondered what goes on behind the scenes at a bowling alley? Reporter Maria Torres shows us more. You may have heard about bowling, but do you know what goes on behind the scenes of bowling? Let's take a look. Now, can you please tell me a little bit about what goes on behind the scenes of bowling? Yeah, well, uh, I basically wait and get all the calls. If there's any calls, yeah, when the people bowl the ball, it basically hits the machine, the pin cushion, and then cycles the machine. And if there's any calls within the it cycling and then bowling, uh, I basically get all the calls. There's basically four types of calls. There's a, a 180, uh, out of range, uh, blackout, and a fatal trigger. There's two ways to cycle in it. There's a, an electronic way, which uh, there's a laser, and if it passes through the laser, it uh, sets off the machine. If that doesn't work, it hits the pit cushion which triggers the machine and it goes through a cycle and then sends your ball back up. So now that you know what goes on behind the scenes of bowling, I encourage you to spread the word around. For Local Matters, this is Maria Fernanda Torres. Reporter Maria Gomez finds out how to be a hairstylist. The hairstyling business has been open to many career opportunities. Monique Marquez is a hairstylist that would tell us more about this career. The process of becoming a hairstylist, what you do first is you find a school, you can go online, you can visit schools for information meetings. After that, the whole process takes 1,600 hours, and after you're done with school, you have to take a state board exam. If you pass a state board, you get your license. If you don't, you have to retake it. And after that, just go out and search for a job. In the hairstyling profession, what other career opportunities are there available? There's different things that you could do. You could always work at, from home. You could work at a salon. You could even work at a hospital. Or if you're very successful, you could even work with celebrities. Most of the time, on summer, people want to have lighter hair and shorter hair. So that's when the highlights come in. Winter time, people want to have longer hair and dark colors. Most people ask me if I have a license or if I went to school to do hair. And you do need a license to do hair. My advice for people that are seeking to get into cosmetology is really go out there and educate yourself on different fields, not just one thing. Cosmetology has different things to offer, so go out there and find it. As we approach the new decade, hairstyling has become an important part in our appearance. If you would like to become a hairstylist, there are many opportunities out there for you. For Local Matters, I'm Maria Gomez. Well, that's all the time we have for now. I'm Joe Mosley. And I'm Maria Torres. Join us next time for more local stories that matter. In athletics, the women's volleyball team won the CCAA championship for the fourth time in seven years. Our women's cross-country team earned NCAA Division II Scholastic All-America Honors for the eighth straight year. The women's basketball team advanced to the NCAA West Regional for the first time since 1998. Jennifer Joy, a junior tennis player, posted the best record in CCAA competition in conference play. As your business searches for smart ways to save, don't forget about the one that's right in front of you. Switch to the Charter Business Bundle and you can save big without sacrificing a thing. Get reliable business telephone and high-speed internet with local support and great features. Power your business with great savings starting today. It's easy to pay less and get more. Call now and make a switch to the Charter Business Bundle.